As you all know, I am an advocate for short hair. I absolutely adore it. But there are times that I really do just wanna play around with a wig and try different lengths, especially on days like this, when my hair just isn't cooperating. Now, I've received my first ever lace front wig from Fabulace Beauty, and I'm really, really excited to wear it out. However, first, can you see I'm gripping the box there with excitement? However, first, I have to fix it to my head. So come on that journey with me because I've never done it before, and I will learn along the way with you. So cute, by the way. I have opened this before. This is like an official unboxing. It was packed way nicer, but I got excited. So inside we have the piece de resistance, the wig, um, a little silk bag to carry it around in to protect the hair. And then underneath we have a much needed wig cap. First I'm just gonna be gelling back my hair really to make sure that all of it's out the way. Um, I normally use that VO5 shockwaves gel because it's got a nice hold and it doesn't dry out my hair too much which is perfect so I'm just gonna lather this on once that's done I'm just gonna take a comb and scrape it all back and away from the face especially behind the ears here <laughs> I already know how this is gonna look stick them up I must look ridiculous right now. I have no idea what I look like. This is hilarious. Uh, ow. Bit of this basically on the airline. So we're gonna fix this. Oh, it's cold. Oh, it's dripping. At this rate, this better be cemented for the next three weeks because I'm not doing this again. It's cold. On guard. When Guardian Leviosa. Oh, Vodka Kadabra. Anyway. <laughs> you basically want to keep this bit, and I'll show you why in the end, because I have no hair. So I can't sew. Down the sharp thing. I can't sew the back in, so I need to be able to flip the elastic over in order to be able to keep this wig cap on my head so that it's not flying everywhere. So, after all that, I'm basically gonna take this and pop it up here. Here she is. I haven't given her a name yet, but I love her. Anyway, so inside, as you can see there, I hope, there's a little clip to go into the back of your wig cap should you need it. There's adjustments here to make it tighter and obviously a strap as well to hold it to the back of your head. <laughs> Sorry, it's always really weird when I see myself with hair. Okay, so now we have the lace front on. <clears throat> You've got to take off the excess with rubbing alcohol. Honestly though, this is my first time doing this. So if there's any tips or tricks, feel free to let me know because there's a whole heap of things I could be doing wrong right now. But this is how we learn. Not gonna lie. I reckon I could go out like this. Alien meets bank robber. I need to get out more. I look like I've got a really big forehead. <laughs> so you're gonna dab on basically layers of wig glue now. <laughs> Woo! Don't you know that you're my sweet joy? Always remember me. Kinda like it. Gonna decide at the end. Using the sharp tool. Gosh, this makes me nervous. Let's try this side. Oh. Good old pineapple. Woohoo. 